Okay, so today, um, I am going to see if I can filter these, um, uh, we, uh, we did an engine flush recently, and this is, a uh, Dexcool, um, the radiator, uh, fluid, and, um, we decided to put new in, and some of these is actually pretty new, we did it recently, so I figured that instead of throwing away, maybe I can filter it, filter it one more time, and plus I get these jug from the water, and they're not doing anything anyway. So, um, I got a filter for my oil. Sorry, the lighting's kind of dark in here because I had to turn the fan off. Um, this is supposed to be 25 micron. So, whatever's in there, if there's any gunks or anything, 25 micron is pretty good. It'll get through. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, try to save the filter it out and then you try to save it for maybe I can use it for our other car um, But like I said, we did a flush recently and it will be such a waste So I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to filter it You can see some black spot in there Definitely there's chunks in there. I'm gonna have to open this up so I can get the, the water to flow a bit better. I drill a hole up top here. I need a hole there so I can refill it back and store it. But um a gallon of these is like twelve dollars. And as you can see um, these are almost two and a half, so it's like two gallons, it's like four bottles right there. Because we did, uh, we did a flush of, oh, so back and forth, it was like two cars this summer. Not summer, but like, maybe October, November, October, or even September. Uh, we did an tile flush on them. Um... And these are the good stuff that came out. I filtered a little bit before um, with just. Uh, I filtered with. Um, I believe it was. Uh, paper towel. I put paper towel on and in a tray. And I put some microfiber cloth on the knee and the paper towel. Um, on like a big strainer and I was able to get all the big stuff out and these are just the little stuff here but as you can see it was it's doing pretty good I'm gonna show you in the camera in a minute what 25 micron catch I guess eh? but other than that if it's 25 micron that's pretty good though this was for my oil actually I, I forgot it for my oil but um I decided to use on these because I didn't want to waste these it would have been a waste to be honest I would have to rinse this out and then because I see some junk on the bottom there anyway that's bottle number one and I'm going to show you see that there are dust all over you see that you can see them all over there. So it does filter out. So far. Now well, comes the second one. So if you really think about it. A gallon. I believe for these type. It's $15. And this is so close to four gallon. So that's sixty dollars right there. So if we had to throw it away, it would have been like sixty bucks right there. 
Because this is a five gallon bucket and look what happened. It's, it's getting up to the top now. I know I, we should get like the cheap stuff, but my dad is like, he's always on Dex Cool. He won't use anything else. He won't use any um, glycol, alcohol, whatever. I, I, I research a lot about Dex Cool. And they say Dex Cool actually gum up. Um, although they said they changed the formula, GM has changed the formula, but it's still kind of gummy in the, in the car, actually. If, when I flush it out, you can see a lot of gummy stuff. And I did filter it out a lot already. This is the second filter, but the second filter, this is a fine filter, because this is 25 micron. So it's really fine right now. But, um... I did try to uh, filter before this and it did came out a lot of like gunk like little tiny gummy stuff that I did catch a lot and like I said I put it on paper towel so I was able to just roll the paper towel and throw it away and then the microfiber is the one that is underneath the paper towel so I did like uh, I would say like a four stage thing I put a bunch of paper towel on top of the thing on the microfiber and then the microfiber would be last and then the and then my strainer um so i kind of took i did took down a lot i would say and you can tell there's almost four gallons i mean five gallons buckets almost there so if you really think about it um they sell like a gallon, the one gallon uh, jug for like 15 bucks. The one we got like $15, 14, four, I believe it's a 14.95 at Walmart. So it's like 15 bucks. And let's see, yeah, there's, there's still chunk right there. You can see them, bunch of them right there, but not much. A uh, bunch of like little fiber, so probably that came from the microfiber itself Since it's like you can see it right there I don't know if you can see them in the camera, but see a bunch of fiber right there So it is came from that so I'm gonna rinse that off, but I guess this is good now Anyway, I am going to end the video Because that's all I needed to know I guess so I'm gonna try to save it and then when I might update on the video here, but there's no need to, but that's how I'm going to filter it. So you can literally, you can reuse your, 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 um, if you do like a big flush and your cooling is recent, you can literally just add that in. And if you worry about like water evaporation and stuff, then add distal water in it. So that way you get your, um, whatever they put in there I'm, I think they put like uh, alcohol glycol or something in there but anyway and they put some pink stuff to, f to fool you but anyway um I guess that's about it so like right there like you said like I said before it's like $60 right there and it took me only a few minutes to to save it um so it is I guess it is uh, savable but anyway I'm gonna put these back and I'm gonna dump it back in the car because like I said 25 micron is pretty small Anyway, that's it on this one.